my voice I want to thank you and praise and shout and sing From my head to my feet I move to the beat My body and my voice praising you my God and King Hi kids! Ako nga pala si Teacher Gia at welcome sa ating virtual Sunday School. Masaya ako na nakasama ulit namin kayo ngayon. Excited na ba ulit kayo? Yan. Pero bago tayo mag-start, tayo muna ay manalangin. O mga bata, paano nga ulit mag-pray? Tama! Kamay nakatiklo, uloy nakayuko, matay nakapiki. Sundan niyo si Teacher ha? Lord! Maraming salamat po sa panibagong araw na binigay niyo sa amin. Sana po marami kaming matutunan. Lord, patuloy niyo po kaming pag-ingatan sa araw-araw. Mahal na mahal po namin kayo. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Very good. Yan. Bago tayo magsimula sa lesson natin, tayo muna ay kakanta at sasayaw. Nag-enjoy ba kayo sa ating song and dance? Yan. Punta na tayo sa ating 
lesson. Panoorin natin ang next na video at after natin manood, tatawag ang mga teacher natin para sa ating discussion at activity. The Miracle of Mercy Paul This is Saul. Saul was a Pharisee who hated the followers of Jesus so much that he would hunt them down to be brought to trial in Jerusalem. And he would even seek to murder them. Saul was uttering threats with every breath, and he was eager to kill the Lord's followers. So he went to the high priest. He asked him to write a letter to the Jews in Damascus that would allow him to arrest any Christians he found there. He wanted to bring them, both men and women, back to Jerusalem in chains. Now Saul went on his way. And as he came near Damascus, a light from heaven flashed around him, and he heard a voice that said, Saul, Saul, why are you persecuting me? Saul cried out, Who are you, Lord? And the voice said, I am Jesus. Rise and go into the city, and you will be told what to do. So Saul got up and he opened his eyes, but he couldn't see anything. So the men who were with Saul led him into the city. After three days, a man named Ananias came to Saul. He put his hands on Saul and immediately Saul could see again. And with that, Saul became a follower of Jesus. He became the very thing he had tried to hunt. And he immediately began telling people that Jesus is the Son of God, and he taught them about the mercy of God that he had received. And all who heard him were amazed. He then went by a new name, Paul, as he began preaching not just to the Jewish people, but to everyone. Despite many difficulties like being imprisoned, shipwrecked, and narrowly escaping death multiple times, Paul continued to preach about Jesus. Paul said that he would do everything he could to save people and help them know God. And that's just what he did in order to reach people who would otherwise be unreached. And many came to know Jesus because of what Paul said. Paul taught many in his day through his letters but even more have come to learn more about Jesus through the letters of Paul that can be read even to this day. <laughs>